Hey guys, welcome back to more Let's Co-op Super Mario Galaxy Uno. I'm K6Cope. And I'm Argon Matrix. No, you're not. You're lying. You can't lying. prove anything. You can't... <laughs> well, I guess I can't prove I'm K6Cope either, then. so basically... True. We We've guys. got, like, we're the witness... We're in the witness protection program, so we can't really talk about that. But, yeah, uh... Yeah, so my name is Johnny Appleseed. Yeah. We're and mine is, a uh, Nicki Minaj. <laughs> <laughs> Any relation to the famous pop star? Uh, so, no, I guess actually. Just, just look. People chance, get us confused a lot because we look pretty similar, but not. Okay, oh, fire. Okay. Oh, fiery dino piranha. Yes. You sound pretty similar too. Mm-hmm. You recognize this guy from Galaxy Two? Oh man, he was the. In a certain thing we were doing, he was like, the fucking bane of my. <laughs> oh existence. my god! Yeah. You know what I'm saying. Uh, Gobblegut's still worse, but. <laughs> Yeah. Oh man, Gobblegut is the worst person ever. Alright, uh, so this might be the episode where we break the triple digits in stars. I didn't. I just didn't even see it coming, man. I, I know, really like, know. I thought we were at, at like two stars, but like, whatever. I like if if we're being honest, I really I, like the last I remember, we just I don't even remember the 70s, 80s, or 90s. I just that's all. The <laughs> last star we always talk about was random shit while we're doing this. <laughs> Like, so. I think the last time we acknowledged it, we were at, like, 69, and that's all I remember. Something like that. Yeah, like, everything's <laughs> it's just because we're always talking about stuff that has, like, nothing to do with the game, so we're not even paying attention half the time. Exactly. But, you know, anybody could talk about the game, but the stuff we talk about, who's going to talk about that? I mean, it has to be done. Yeah, who's going to relate me to Nicki Minaj if I don't do it? Exactly. Mm -hmm. Probably okay, no one. Does this actually take... Oh, it does take me where I want to go. Yeah. Stick that in your pipe and smirk it. This planet is just... Not this planet, this galaxy is so random. They've just got, like, a semi-planet sticking out of the sun. <laughs> and, like, that upside-down saucer. It with, is, it is with pretty sling stupid, star. I guess. But. It's pretty random. It just really doesn't make sense. I guess it's they sort of anywhere. realistic, except for the stuff that everything's not burning to death. But, like, it's like space debris ca crashed to the star. <laughs> yeah, except for Mario should be in a million pieces of death right now. Yeah, he hell, it's like exist. this, like, rocky planet. This freaking molten rock planet should be like burning too but <laughs> there should literally be nothing on the surface of this planet yeah unless but. it's really water and it's just odd colored or is it secretly death water it's death water hey, do i do i just have to kill all the enemies here is that the idea that's some, that's because we I were mean, on... there's rarely any parts of mario games where they make you kill all the enemies i know apparently that's it though because we were on this planet one time before, we had to collect star chips instead, which is much more orthodox. Than, uh, yeah, that's, see, that's normal for a Mario game. Collect the thon. It feels so weird. It feels so weird to say the word orthodox. I'm, like, I'm so used to saying unorthodox to describe things. Like, how do you, how do exactly, you say like, orthodox? That's, yeah, I feel that way about underwhelmed too. Do you ever really say whelmed? <laughs> like guess, you're just content. I guess. I like. You I know, say like, underwhelmed and overwhelmed, but yeah, all the time. God, but these do you things. Ever look say at whelmed? The, no. Yeah. Look how beautiful these is things are. Is it even possible like, to be whelmed? Like, is that know. just being being normal? I guess. You know, this reminds me of Star Fox 64 Solar. It kind of does. Like, things these things up. are like a lot more slow and beautiful than that, though. Like, there's, there's yeah, the white tip is so mesmerizing. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, this plan is bullshit. I fucking hate this. this. is the worst fucking plan in the whole fucking game. God damn it. Well, God, it hates you, too. Jeez, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, What's God. so bad about it? It doesn't look that bad. Uh, well, it's... Do you have bad memories with this? Yeah. Is it a childhood thing? It's not so bad in, like, retrospect, I guess. You just had one rage-induced night that you totally regret, don't you? Something like that. You know, one... A one-night stand or something. <laughs> a one-night stand, but with lots of death. You know what it is? This this planet actually reminds me of, like a like, a certain area in Donkey Kong Country Returns. And that game is bullshit all the way through. So. Yeah, that game is 100% bullshit. I mean, blowing, is that really a move? Blowing on yeah, flowers. That's dumb. Seriously. Blowing. Alright, oh, where are we now? Like, you blow. <laughs> you just blow, yeah. Alright, uh, there's another star over here. I want it. Yes. Donkey Kong does not blow. What the fuck? That. There's, like, nothing tangible to stand on here that's, like, not sinking. And you're right, yeah, I mean, I refuse to believe it. He just blow. <laughs> blow. You blow flowers. Yeah, I I more believe in the rolling. Can't. I don't even do that shit in real life. All right. I don't think we've ever talked to one of these guys, but uh, he sells you a 1-up or a power mushroom, so I'll just take this one. 
Oh my god, you're spending our well-earned star bits. How could you? You didn't even consult me first, man. Yeah, it's not like we need them, except that like some guy said we need did need them because we need to get like 9,999 for the funds. That's like, you know, if that's like if in real life we had a joint checking account and you just went and bought like some stupid fucking arcade machine or something. Well, that's not fair. Except that would be awesome. That's not fair because that actually happened. So. Yeah, exactly. But it's not fair. <laughs> it's so fair. But then again, if you bought an arcade machine, I wouldn't be mad at you. That's like, okay, what'd you buy? A one up or a power stream? Power stream. Okay, so that's like you're doubling your life. So that's like you buying a cryogenic freezing machine to make sure you live double. Well, pardon the of me life if I love Walt Disney. Well, so do I, but that doesn't mean you can go spend our money on a cryogenic freezing machine. <laughs> We're not even talking about this boss fight. This is just so. So this boss is a bitch. It's because we already fought this boss when he wasn't fiery, so... Exactly, and he was just as underwhelming then. I'm very whelmed right now by this boss. Exactly, I am so whelmed. Oh no, Mario's overwhelmed. You, I don't think you're allowed to put a, like an adjective in front of whelmed. Like, I'm so whelmed, because then you become overwhelmed. <laughs> so is so whelmed that you're so, overwhelmed. So is not an adjective. Well, you know. It's a modifier. It could, it could, be, it could be referred to as a lot. Ah, true. So if you're very whelmed, are you just oh my very, God. very content? I or does it stack? Like, are, as you get more whelmed, do you get closer to being overwhelmed? You do realize that this is the stupidest conversation we've ever had, right? I, you know, <laughs> it has some validity to it. <laughs> I guess, are, yeah. Just the discussion of words. I, like, I get what you're saying. It's just like... But what do you... Th I know you don't care, but just tell me. You just, just no one just would use the word whelmed in real life because there's no point. Exactly. That's why it's so interesting. Why am I going to die? What the fuck? This guy's actually pretty easy, but I'm making it a lot harder because we're talking about whelming people or something. So what, what? I'm saying is... Oh. Do you think it's an overreaction if a man gives another man's wife a foot massage and he throws him off a building into a glass house? Well, that all depends on which hemisphere you live in. I don't know which hemisphere I live in. I live in the middle hemisphere, so it's okay. Oh yeah, me too. Let's get another one from this guy. Except because I might actually need it. Because apparently there you go, man. Spending more of our savings. Because apparently this guy is harder than I all? remember. Yeah, I've bought two cryogenic things now. Sorry. Did you die? Yeah. Oh my god. That's why I'm not fighting the boss anymore. I thought you were just doing a different star or something. Oh my god. <laughs> I forgot to pick up the power shroom, but I like, got it as I launched out of the star. That was weird. That's so weird. I've never seen like a launch star animation freeze mid-launch. <laughs> it is pretty cool. I must be the first person to ever pick up a power shroom mid-launch star. I highly doubt that. I hope I am, though. Because <laughs> then I'll feel so on. special. Dream on. Alright, yeah, so I gotta focus on this guy. This was divine intervention. Do you know what Divine Intervention is? Uh, it's the name of some episode of NCS and Majora of Mask. Didn't Correct. see that one coming, did you? No, that was the answer I was looking for. Okay, good. Alright, yeah, I this guy This guy obviously, like, he was the first boss of the game, so he wasn't hard when you fought him when he wasn't fiery, but now it's kind of nasty. I, th I like how they did that too, how like the first boss of the game is the same as the last boss of the game. Or like, well not the last, but... But it's just like, it's the same what fight except do that? one change and it makes all the difference because it's actually hard because you have to time your hits really well. I'm trying to think of what other games have like first and final bosses is the same. I was going to say Super Mario RPG because you fight Bowser first, but then I realized, oh wait, it's like a Mario game where Bowser's not the final boss. I totally exactly, forgot. yeah, it's like, what? Yeah. Whatever. Be cool, but no. This might be our last escapade in Melty Molten. Uh, we could have something big here. We could have something big here. We have something big here! Okay. <laughs> Whoever gets this is going to win the game. Fiery Dino. We're at 98. 98 times we got a star. Really? I didn't notice. How many of those are hidden stars from Toad? Those are the easy ones to get. Or is that a different game? No, no, that's this game. We got that like six times. Ooh, Speedy Comet. Let's do it. Red Knot. Ooh, yeah, your favorite galaxy. Where did I see Dreadnought? Oh, yeah. I think Final Fantasy XII, Dreadnought Leviathan was the name of the ship or something. Dreadnought Leviathan. That's not. St that's stupid, just combining two really good words like that. 
But that's a b if you had a ship named the Dreadnought Leviathan, it, you would think it was badass. Don't lie, it would be badass. Yeah, it's true. Because like Dreadnought still. is awesome, and Leviathan is awesome, so that's like. But people would think you're so pretentious. Awesome. Oh my god, why do I have six minutes for a speed run? That's I not a speed know. run. That's just dumb. But that's just walking a little bit faster than usual. Yeah, can I get up there? Yeah. Okay. I'm not. I don't think that's how you're supposed to do that. <laughs> just backflip up to that. I think you're supposed to bounce off that guy or something. Yeah. Well, there was like another green guy that you could bounce off on the other side of the planet. I think I saw. So Probably there is that. Over. Anyways, like I was saying, Dreadnought Leviathan. Yeah. I mean, people would think you're pretentious, but they wouldn't think that if you blow their fucking face off with the Dreadnought Leviathan. Yes, they would. So problem solved. <laughs> They'd you be like, damn it, everybody how could I die to something as stupid as the Dreadnought Leviathan? But then they don't exist anymore, so it's all good. Problem Speak solved. Speaking of Leviathan, that's a really good name for that one, for the Zelda boss, Tentalus in Skyward Sword. It's like Abyssal Leviathan Tentalus. Oh, yeah. In, in Skyward Sword, I haven't played it. They're still doing the... Did they follow, like, the two... The two, like, words before the... Boss's actual name, or like they did Twilight uh, something, Princess, something like that. Or s are some of them still three, like Ocarina of Time and Jora Mask style? I think that I think some. I can't remember. I haven't played it in forever, but and I never so beat I it either. Three something. better. It just gave it more room. I mean, in Majora's Mask, it didn't really count because everyone was had masked in it. But like Ocarina of Time, you know. Yeah, and then in Wind Waker, there's like fuck that, <laughs> just get rid of all yeah, the other. Yeah, in Wind Waker, it's just like. So one I have to word, put those it? in. No, it's, it's it, it doesn't give the boss a title. <laughs> Oh, yeah. That's just Dude, crazy. can I bounce on this guy before I waste all my time on this one satellite? There we go. Probably because they didn't want to, like, acknowledge the fact that they reused boss names, even, like, Goma and shit. Yeah, true, but you can find about, out about all that if you uh, go to the Nintendo Gallery, so... True. Very true. Alright. Oh, this is the place I died before. Do you remember this? I do, yeah. That but some so of them still had to, like, Infernal Dinosaur, King Dodongo. Yeah, for but that doesn't count because King Dodongo, King should be part of the upper words. Yeah, so, like, like, what about like the the monstrous Helmarok King? Like, where do you draw the line between title and name? I I would say monstrous Helmarok King is just all the name. That's just the name. He doesn't have a title. Well, maybe. I mean, I would say his name is just King, and monstrous Helmarok is just describing him because he is a monster. He is monstrous, and he's a Helmarok, and he's the king of that. So I think he should have a king. Yeah, but like if he's king of the helm of the Helmrocks, then like wouldn't it like Helmrock King be his like full name? I was thinking that too. And but then, then like the monst, but describing. like the monstrous that doesn't even sound like a title at all. So. I would just remove the, the and just put monstrous as the describing, and then Helmrock King. But you'd have to like that doesn't sound right. You'd have to add another word in there. Something like, like that. He would have to have a specific name like like James like or monstrous something. Leviathan. <laughs> Helmarok King. <laughs> Monstrous Dreadnought Leviathan. Yes. Helmarok okay. King. <laughs> Alright. Or his I... name could be James. Monstrous Helmarok King James. Okay, this is ridiculous. I'm down, I'm at the final planet now, and I still have half my time left. I just ran out of half my time. And you were slacking, too. You were, like, I was, Yeah, I was going lazy, and I was. we were talking about Wind Waker, just being totally out of it. Such unprofessional LPers, and I still made it with 247 to spare. And you're, you're probably going to kill him with 216 left still, so it's going to be great. Is that your estimate, 216? Yeah, but now you're going to do it. I shouldn't have told you, because now you're not going to do 216 just to spite me. I'm going to do 217. <laughs> you can you can choose when to do it, too, you cheat. No, I'm probably going to do it like way before that. I don't know. It's, it's going to be close here. Chitty chitty bang bang. Oh my god. Yeah, you were so wrong. 223! 223! Well, you didn't pick up the star yet. Uh, that's Time's true. Still going. <laughs> they don't do that in Galaxy 2. They stop the timer once you, like, kill the boss. 218. That was 217 and a half. It said 218. You were wrong. I was wrong. We all lose. No! I bet lose. someone in the comments said 217 and a half. Good day, sirs. Yeah, they did. You get a cookie, commenter. Yeah, but they only said after, I get, after like, right now, they posted the comment, so... Oh, it doesn't matter. There's no way we could know. Exactly. So they win a cookie. All right, we have 99 stars. 99 times. So, are we gonna are we gonna do this one star in deep dark as our hundredth and epic one, or are we gonna do this like hidden one here? 
Or I don't know. Well, you actually know which star is which, so which one's epic or... I don't remember this one, and I don't remember this one. Which one is higher on the epicosity level? I don't know, because I haven't played them in, like, such a long well, time. Well, either way, we'll be surprised. I think I think the uh, Deep Dark one will probably be pretty cool. Maybe not, though. Mm, I'm, I'm allowed to go for it. We haven't done Deep Dark at all in this episode, so it's only fair. But I fucking hate Deep Dark. It sucks. No, it doesn't. It's awesome. Is this the one where we got lost? It is. Yeah, Guppy and the, the Underground water? Lake. Yes. Oh, my God. Is that a good one? No, it's, it's actually pretty boring. <laughs> <laughs> I don't you care. Were just like yes. I don't care. A hundred is just a number. So. Look at him. He's really smug awesome ass number. again. I can never get over how smug Guppy looks. He's just like, yeah, I'm the best. He's never unhappy. He's always so happy. He's, He's like, in a constant state of happiness. Right. I want that one. I never noticed those like prongs in the ship, like that it lands with. Mm -hmm. Those weren't there in Galaxy Two or something. Mm -hmm. Well, did the ship ever land in Galaxy Two? I don't think so. I probably <laughs> crashed a few times. Like, <laughs> oh, I just like killed their meat. What's this guy no, saying? Oh, my meat! Is no, that my meat! My <laughs> roast is toast. <laughs> oh, that's what you get for fucking around, man. Yeah. Once no. again, Guppy's here helping us get our hundredth star. And what are you guys doing? Seriously. Shitting around. Is this crab gonna kill me? Okay, better. <laughs> Crusty crab pizza. No. You're gonna die. No. Man. I'm You're very unlucky. Die. Why would I die? That's just the stupidest thing ever. I agree, but it happens. To the best of us. Shit happens. <sighs> Except when I get two coins in a row like that. Oh, this toad's at least giving the appearance of wanting to go help. Let's see. And he's got glasses. Please, you gotta run Guppy right out of here! Why? He's awesome. He's the good guy, you are the bad guy. We've already come to this uh, conclusion. He does more work than you damn toads. <laughs> exactly, fuck you toads, and there are like a hundred of you, and there's one of him. Yeah, like he's, he's the on one that's team. gonna give me the star here, not you. Once again, right? Like for the third time in a row. Yeah, seriously, what the balls, man. I don't think toads do anything, ever, in either games. They give you stars in Mario 64, that's about it. And in New Super Mario Bros. Wii, they like shoot the cannons oh, of yeah. the propeller shrooms hey, and the penguin What? Shrooms. You again? You gotta be kidding me. You want to run me out of this lake? You gotta get through all eight rings. Oh shit! This is oh, actually so kind of hard. This, uh, but this is a dire, dire docks manta ray. Yeah, dire, man. dire cock situa situation thing. A redux, if you will. Except it's a lot easier than that one somehow. Yeah, because you can actually see the fucking rings. Yeah, but regardless, it's still hard because he takes this really weird path, like between certain two rings. I'm gonna get the shell. Should help. Maybe. Yeah. Do these things like refill my air? They do a little bit. Probably enough. Mm. And well, see, he's like trying to go through all these obstacles and stuff, but they're all like super slow moving or totally stationary, so it's like <laughs> retarded. Okay. Oh, and then that one ring there tries to trick you because it wasn't really a ring. It does, it. yeah. It's just like a speed up ring. Uh, okay. Yeah, and then if that, and, the, and then if you speed up, you're fucked. Okay, where's the last ring? It's over there, oh, behind no. all that shit. Look at that. That's the one that always screws me up because it's behind these like cyclones. What an asshole! I know, and there it is. Yeah. Well, that was that was an easy hundred star. Hell yeah. All right, what do you got to say as your final, as your last hurrah, Guppy? Where are you? Do I really care? Because that, that's the question. Oh, here he goes. Uh, uh, I can't. I'm reading like half of his text. Let's see. I'm a fish of my word. Okay, that's boring. Shoot a torpedo to help you shoot. See if I can actually get the star before I die here, though. Well, maybe. Yeah, you do. Dude, what the oh, ball? Look at his face. Oh my God. <laughs> he is so. He's shaking his head like Donkey Kong. That's what he's like doing. I was getting look a much lower frame rate, and like one of the frames, his eyes were like closed. It looked like he was sleeping. Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna get this air. I don't know why I'm having problems with this star. But I don't know. Let's take a wide berth around there. And just ram my face right into it. Yes. Oh, baby. Star yeah. one zero zero. Got to see no to stars, man. There's it's all about the Bordens. There's only like oh. we're so we're technically like five sixths of the way there. Essentially, yeah. Roughly. Roughly, very roughly. And that's that, um, so it looks like, let me just take a quick peek here, we're pretty much done here, done here, done here, so all we have is this one hidden star here, 
and then we're going to the end of the game. And then we're coming oh. back. Then we're coming back for purple coins. Oh boy! And the three trial galaxies. We still have to think about that. Trial. So galaxy. we still got a lot to go, folks. Don't think it's over quite yet, but trial. Shut up. Unregistered hyper cam to you. And so should we end it off right now, or should we go for this last one? Let's see, what is better to have as an end of an episode? Getting your 100th star or clearing out an area? What do you think? What I'm thinking is, what's better to have at the beginning of a video? Like, is it, would it be just better to go right to the final, well, actually, like, yeah. Gauntlet against Bowser? or When you put it that way, yeah, d yeah, let's do this star right now. We're doing an extra long better. episode for you guys today, because I think this star could take a while. Because but... although I do think ending on 100 is better than ending when finishing an area, I think starting on the final gauntlet instead mm -hmm. of getting one random star and then starting outweighs that vastly. Mm -hmm. That's way cooler. So we actually saw like how to get to this hidden star the very first time we went to this galaxy there was that hungry Luma we didn't have to have star bits for if you remember. Yeah, we were like few, uh, just a few star bits. We were like five star bits away and I'm like oh well <laughs> just Fuck walked that. away. <laughs> so give me five more star bits bitch. Is, is, are, these, are these rocks in the shape of something? Those two look like an eye. Which ones? Like eyes, Back here? the ones you just passed. Like those are. Oh eyes my god! Yeah, they, they do. It looks it's like, like an unhappy face. It's like the shoop de whoop face. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, it is. That's funny. I don't know if that's purposeful or accident, but it's gotta be purposeful. It's gotta be. Mm. Nothing's an accident with Nintendo. Exactly. I mean, these lava spires, shape of a penis, not an accident. Nope. Everything is shaped. It's so phallic. Exactly. That's See, one. Those things are Star Fox like. Yeah. That's one thing for anyone who ever asked for like LP commentary advice. If you can't think of anything to say, just look for something phallic, and you're good. So, and if you're playing a Nintendo game, chances are you're gonna find it. Oops. Yeah, pretty much. Or you could just imitate one of Mario's many sound effects. That's what I do. <laughs> yeah, you get by somehow. That's gotten to you to like 10,000 subscribers almost. Yeah, man, you could just I could just do that for a whole episode. And literally, I would I would think it's <laughs> fucking hilarious. Oh my god, yeah. Here we go. Yeah, so it's kind of epic. It's kind of like anticlimactic that we're not going to be ending on a hundred stars this episode. But you know, a hundred and one, like a hundred and one Dalmatians, is an awesome movie. So there, there yeah. you go. That's justified. Plus, it's a palindrome, and that's awesome too. So. That's true. It's a palindromic number. On hundred and one Dalmatians, what was the hundred and no hundred and one Dalmatians is the original. Hundred and two Dalmatians, they were like the hundred and second Dalmatian is the one with no spots, right? Just like that. Something old like white that. One. Oh, hey, look, a hundred and one. Oh wow, how <laughs> fucking hilarious is that? Oh my god, except we have to give like 80 to this guy, so yeah. So if we already had 101 stars, we'd have two 101s on our screen, that'd be epic. That would be so great. So fabby. Yes, oh my god, this guy takes them so slow. There we go. <laughs> That's what she said. Transform! That might be the last Hungry Luma. Oh my god, I'm so oh, sad. Oh no! No! Don't die! <laughs> oh. We've killed them all. A new planet was born. And now he's just a planet. He can't even move. That's boring. Yeah. What was he gonna do as a fucking planet? I hope you're happy, Mario. You just ethnic cleansed all the hungry Lumas in the universe. Yeah. <laughs> Except for the one in the galaxy, too. So that's okay. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, I, new. Uh, oh, this planet's gonna be fun. I can already tell. Oh, this reminds me of fucking Aladdin. Just for some reason. Mm -hmm. Lava level. <laughs> I don't know. This planet's cool because it's like all lava y and pretty and it appeals to my love of like fire and shit oh my god how am I going to avoid these guys but like it's just kind of stupid that like you just have to wait around for most of the time like you don't want to do that in a video game you, you want to be moving and shit yeah I mean I guess like these obstacles here serve a bit yeah, of I don't, I don't really approve of puzzles that like you just have to wait them out and avoid them for a set amount of time until you can move on like I don't like those yeah that's dumb I like just having an obstacle and being able to get past it, no like time restraint. Like maybe if there's like the screen is scrolling or something and you have to like do it within a certain amount of time, but not that you have to just wait there purposely. Yeah. Although I'm not a game designer, so I can't really say, I guess. Yeah, but you know, we're the clientele, we're obliged. Our opinions matter, you know. Yeah. The customer's always right. Yeah, so we are right, so fuck you, game designers. <laughs> oh, is this the last silver star? It is. Oh how epic, round top of the flagpole. They yeah. kind of planned it like that, though, because you yeah, do have to follow, like, a weird path, mm -hmm. kind of. Oh, and they just put it right out there in, like, the middle of the lava. I'm gonna Thanks. jump for it. Ooh. Oh, I almost landed on it. 
Aww. Whatever. That would have been kind of cool. But That's... yeah, I love when you get it after you hit fire and he's all flashing while you get the star. That's <laughs> so dumb. <laughs> um... Like, he's still hurting, but his face is so happy. <laughs> he's like, yes. Yeah. Uh, and that is the garden. It's clear. We're done. Eh, Except for fuck that garden. fucking purple coins. But... It's Balam garden. Balam. Yup. Alright, and save the game. Well, that actually didn't take as long as I thought it would, so... Oh yeah, so this is... We've, we've made episodes this long before. No BD. Yep. Ooh, I like how the first, like, three digits in our star count are 1, 2, 3. It's like... Yeah. Numeric order. It's cool. One, two, Anyways, three, um... Unless you have any final remarks, I'm gonna do our outro now. 1, 2, 3, 8. Thanks Isn't everyone like for watching. Oh, what? I was just, like, thinking... there was. Didn't you say something like that in a Wind Waker episode about how, like, four-digit numbers... And then the last one was just like random, like one, two, three, eight, you know, like like that. Um, some I I sorted it, but mine was more like if the first three digits are the same, like mine was like I had one. Oh, like one, 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 eight or something. Yeah, like I had that, like yeah. one, 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 three rupees, and that's what spawned that. So. Well, sequential one, two, three, kind of the same, but different. Sorted, yeah. Anyway. Anyways, I, I was just speculating. Whatever, do the outro. I was. Okay, rapping. so thank you everyone so much for watching this episode. I love you all so much. I would take you to Six Flags any day of the week. We would fuck you. We would do it. Yes, at Six Flags um, on the roller coaster. And next time, we have this to take on. Center of the Universe. Bum, bum, so, bum. on that note, thanks everyone for watching. This is Argon Matrix and... K6 Schizo. And we'll see you guys next time when we quote-unquote finish the game. Wait, you're not Argon Matrix. You're Nicki Minaj. And Damn I'm it, my cover's proceed. been blown! No! <laughs> I ran we out of my power or, up. <laughs> we may or may not return next episode, depending on if we die. Exactly. Alright. Bye, folks. Peace.